Hello, everyone. Thanks for joining us on hey. this Hi. Wednesday. And oh, 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 mysterious <laughs> third voice. Okay.、Um, thanks for joining us on Wednesday、um, episode of Ludo Lingo. This this would fall into our discussion segment where we are going to talk all about everything we know about the Last of Us movie, which、everything. is nothing. All, which all is nothing. Which means that. We should probably talk about what we want to know or what we want to see in the film.、Um, oh, boy, the thing that obviously has to be said first is、um, which. Okay, which whenever you start any film, well, this is how it should be. In some cases, unfortunately, it's not in Hollywood, but、uh, every film has to start with the foundation, which is the script, and. Everything comes from there, which,、um, just film kid side note,、Neil. it's it's horrible that writers are so underappreciated and no one knows who they are because literally nothing in entertainment would exist without them. But、um, so you need a good script. So I'm very happy that Neil Druckmann is is writing it. He wrote The Last of Us, and obviously. Even if even if there was a better writer, like you know whatever, who had better laurels or whatever in Hollywood that could write the script, they shouldn't <laughs> because it's not theirs.、Okay. And、um, I didn't even know that, so okay, that's good. <laughs> yeah, he's writing it. I didn't know it was like confirmed enough that it was actually like that they could say that he was writing it. Yeah, he totally like, I is. I thought this was just some random rumor again. I wasn't really paying attention. Yeah, well, there's only been one piece of news on it, and it's that Sony's like subsidiary company or whatever, Screen Gems, is making it. The director of the three first Spider-Man movies, Sam Raimi, and he did um. Wait, what's that movie? Gone, gone to hell, dragged to hell. What's it called? Drag me to hell. <laughs> drag me to hell. Yeah. That the, so the Spider-Man movies and Drag Me to Hell.、Um, he's producing it. Obviously, they don't have a director yet because there's there's nothing there's no script or anything. And then yeah, Neil is writing it.、Um, yeah, I guess the first thing you want to say when this happens is that Troy Baker should be, but no, no he he shouldn't be. It, he、I、should、know. not be. I know, but like, <laughs> it's just he doesn't obviously doesn't look like him. But like having somebody else do that voice is just that's the only thing that's well weird. I think Hugh Jackman would be perfect. I guess. <laughs> I guess. <laughs> I mean, you, I, do you think Ashley Johnson would actually be able to play Ellie?、She's、not at all. She's like,、old. she's in her twenties. Yeah, they could like cut her off at the knees or something. <laughs> And I saw today on on some I don't know where I saw it, but it was so stupid. It was like an online petition for uh, uh, Ellen Page to play Ellie. I was like, <laughs> come on! Like she's like twenty five or something. I don't know how old she is, but. Uh, like I know she looks like her, but no, you need. Yeah, that's the other problem with this is that like how that's gonna be really hard to find somebody that's good enough to actually play Ellie because yeah, like that's a really strong role to yeah, f- like a young girl to try to do. Yeah, I was I was like thinking about all the characters and, and casting them in my head, and Ellie's the only one where I'm not like yeah, that's the person that should play her. Yeah. Because、uh, I don't know, there's not. They should just do really bad、um, voice dubbing over with the <laughs> actual voice actors, but then get ran- random other actors, <laughs> and then don't lip sync it properly. I said they should just have Hugh Jackman as Joel, and then cut to in-game footage whenever Ellie talks. <laughs> 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 it would have to be literally exactly the same, and follow somebody <laughs> playing、yeah. the game. Yeah. So it, the movie would have like you messing up and dying. <laughs> <laughs> be like movie over. They would restart. <laughs> oh my gosh! No, but it's exciting. Yeah, I guess. Really, it's like, exciting. I, I'm just. I would say I'm excited, but it's like every six months, there's like this new this game is getting a movie, and then it doesn't happen. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I okay. Guess the, the only thing that's actually gotten anywhere is the Assassin's Creed one, but it's still not here. Yeah, but it's being made. Like it's, it's、yeah. completely being made. <laughs> Yeah. Um. But I think, like, okay, Michael Fassbender is, whatever, attached to the Assassin's Creed one, and he's, well, he, okay, he's really talented. I don't care what you say. <laughs> what? Why don't they get that? Um. Oh, what's that guy's name from Drive? 
He should play Joel. Ryan Gosling? Nicholas Cage. <laughs> what? Nicholas Cage? Not Nicholas Cage. Well, that could work. I, I never shed that, Caleb. Um, <laughs> no, Christopher Walken. Oh, wow. All these zombies. <laughs> these <just> everywhere. <laughs> um, no, but what I was going to say was that aside from the Assassin's Creed movie, which, okay, it has talent tied to it, but that doesn't really mean that it's going to be good. I think this is the first video game movie I've heard of that's like, okay, maybe this could actually be a good video game movie because this is the first... Um, video game adaptation to film that you can kind of be confident that might be good. Okay, yeah. Because, like I said, um, Michael Fassbender is with Assassin's Creed and he's very talented and he's done good work. That doesn't really mean anything. Mm -hmm. But if you have the original writer and you have Sony um, producing it and you have Sam Raimi like as the producer and then if you get a director that knows what he's doing then I don't think there's a way that it could Michael be Bay? A... <laughs> you're so funny um, I don't think it's possible that it could be like a bad video game movie maybe it could be a not okay. you know like it might not be an exceptional film but you know it'll be to its roots it'll be true it'll please the audience and you know it'll just be a good film I guess I'll be excited when it's way closer to actually existing. In two but years. The or... one thing that's exciting me as of right now, this information, is just that maybe this means they're not making another The Last of Us. <laughs> and that excites you, yeah. And they're just I know what you mean, it, yeah. making a movie, done. Yeah. Yeah. Maybe yeah. they can just leave this be. Yeah, hopefully. For at least 10 years. Okay, so I hope that. Um, the, okay, not even Neil and Bruce, but just the Last of Us team. They have reason to be proud and all that stuff, but I just hope they don't get cocky because I was saying that I'm so I'm still not pissed. It doesn't really matter, but I'm just so r razzled that <laughs> it, 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 about the news that Amy Henning left Naughty Dog, and it just, yeah, there was an update to that story, and they apparently said that um, they are really upset that that false news spread because they had it, there's nothing like bad but she she didn't give any reason as to why she left uh, I don't think no no I don't think she's talked about it yet if she ever will I don't know what I, I have no idea what happened so yeah because I but just I'm, I just see them as that. like such a, a team like a family even though they have two games I just yeah. I, th I thought they were all friendly <laughs> But yeah, um, that's a little bit off topic. But anyway, yeah, I'm excited for the film, and I hope, I hope it gets made. <laughs> it it would be pretty interesting. Yeah, I'd watch it. Yeah, for sure. If you know what I mean. A few times even. So, um, th <laughs> <laughs> thanks for joining us on our Wednesday discussion episode. Um, Thank you. On Friday, come back, and we are talking about. Ah, we're doing a Spotlight On episode. So, come back then and uh, hear us talk mm. about two two very similar yet very, very different games. Um, thanks Indeed. for watching. See you next time. Goodbye. Bye.